What games or apps can I access after jailbreaking my Xbox One? Hello, game enthusiasts. Today, we're going to delve into an interesting topic, jailbreaking your Xbox One. Now, keep in mind, jailbreaking involves potential risks, and it's a practice that is generally not endorsed by game manufacturers. However, if you're curious about what jailbreaking can offer, this video is for you. We will take a peek at some of the games and apps that become accessible after you jailbreak your Xbox One. What does jailbreaking mean? Jailbreaking, in a nutshell, means removing the restrictions set by the manufacturer on a device. When it comes to Xbox One, these restrictions typically involve limiting what software can be run on the system. After jailbreaking, you may be able to install and run apps or games that are not usually allowed or available on the standard Xbox One. What can I access after jailbreaking? Once you jailbreak your Xbox One, you can potentially access 1. Homebrew apps and games. Homebrew apps and games are essentially ones made by developers outside of the traditional commercial environments. They are typically not found on official stores, like the Xbox Store. Homebrew can range from simple games to sophisticated apps, often created by enthusiast developers. 2. Emulators. Emulators are software that enable one computer system, the host, to behave like another system, the guest. Post jailbreaking, you might be able to install emulators to play games from other console systems, such as the NES, SNES, or even the PlayStation series. 3. Custom interfaces and themes. Custom interfaces or themes that are typically not available on the standard Xbox One can be applied, giving your console a personalized touch. What are the risks? As much as jailbreaking seems appealing, it's important to understand that there are risks involved. 1. Warranty void. Once a console is jailbroken, the warranty provided by the manufacturer is usually voided. 2. Online service ban. There's a chance you could be banned from using online services like Xbox Live if the console is detected as jailbroken. 3. Risk of malware. The risk of downloading and installing malware increases as you will be installing software from unverified sources. 4. System stability. Jailbreaking can lead to system instability, causing your console to crash or behave unpredictably. There you have it, folks. Jailbreaking your Xbox One can certainly open up a world of new opportunities in terms of games and apps. However, it's essential to understand that jailbreaking comes with its own set of risks and potential downsides. Whether or not to jailbreak is a decision that should be made carefully and responsibly. Stay informed and game on!